This YCN segment is brought to you by New London Hospital, an affiliate of Dartmouth-Hitchcock. It's time for the Salt Hill Pub Picks of the Week. Salt Hill Pub, honest food, perfect pints, live music, now here to serve you in five locations. Welcome back, YCN Sports Talk, Jeremy Stell, Rob Taylor. We got our Salt Hill Pub Picks of the Week, Rob. Doing things a little bit differently. Only the two games, we already picked those. So we're going to go with the top five Patriots postseason moments. And uh, been a lot of them. As you can see, the eight up here, there's plenty more to choose from. We only can choose our top five, so I'm sure we'll leave some out. Just have to, they'll just have to deal with that. So apologies to the rest of the league. I know that everybody hates us because we <laughs> have so many moments right. to pick from now. And what a pleasure it has been to be a Patriots fan. Um, so we're starting from number five and counting down to number one. I'm going with my man Brewski. Teddy Brewski really, to me, represents the Patriots ethic. And he's just such a standout stud of a guy for us and a class act, the whole stroke yep. coming back. So I'm going with a moment, Teddy Brewski, um, for number five. It's right, you right touch there. The actual one. There Not it the is. Sorry. Spot, yeah? Sorry. So that was <laughs> Super Bowl 49 or 39. Yep. Uh, he intercepted uh, Donovan McNabb yes, and uh, really shut down any any chances of them coming back. The Eagles were dead at that moment. And that's one of those ones you could kind of forget about in the pantheon of so many great ones. So I'm glad you reminded us. Yes. And there we go. Yes. And my number five, not a huge moment exactly. I'm going to go with LeGarrette Blunt scoring four touchdowns in the AFC Divisional game. Big game for LeGarrette Blunt. Patriots beating Andrew Luck. I was at the game, so that kind of makes it a little bit more special. Saturday night game, big game. So he gets the uh, four touchdowns. That's my number five pick. All right, so getting up to my number four, see if I can get this right. <laughs> I'm going with the Vinatieri kick to beat the Panthers. Uh, if you remember that one, it was kind of a redux yes. of the first, first win one. that yep. they had. And so I just remember it was like coming down at the end of the game and you're saying to yourself, is this really going to happen again? I just couldn't believe it. Yeah, and it, and did. it did. Exactly. It was, awesome. it was perfect. My number four, if I can find it here, it is Drew Bledsoe coming in in the AFC Championship game against the Steelers. That was the year, obviously, Bledsoe got hurt, Brady came in, but then Brady getting hurt in the AFC Championship game, Bledsoe coming in and beating uh, the Steelers and making it to their first Super Bowl. So there's number four. Who do you have for number three? Up to number three. It wasn't a Super Bowl moment. We were talking uh, playoff postseason, yep. so I'm going with what we call the snowball. There you go. The Vinatieri kick to beat the Raiders, if you remember. Mm -hmm. Alex has it as the tuck rule game. What a game what that a game. was. A roller coaster of emotions. We thought we were dead. It turned out it was the tuck. Yep. They got the call right, although never never anybody <laughs> in wildest imagined what would we have imagined that happens? So. Right, and nobody would imagine that that kind of would have catapulted to this run that they've been on. That was really uh, kind of that game because it was the game before the Bledsoe game, and I am taking that one as well. And once again, it kind of was not a big moment, but it ended up being a bigger moment than it was, obviously, in the history of the Patriots. Now we got the top two picks. What do you have? Tough to kind of narrow it down. Obviously, this one is so close to being one of my best. But it really is the first win, right. and it's the Vinatieri kick right there yep. uh, to win against the Rams. You know, time kicking off the clock, and we kick the field goal to win it all. If you remember that one, it was John Madden was the color analyst. Yeah, he couldn't believe we were going for the win at the end. We should be playing for overtime, and I remember Troy Brown and just everybody just putting it all yep. together in the last few seconds. All right, my number two is Malcolm Butler getting the interception against the Seahawks. Obviously an iconic moment. Patriots looked like they were down and out on the goal line. Butler comes up with it, gets the interception, falls down at the one yard line, and they get the win. A very exciting moment. Who's your number one? So I'm going, I'm going. Your, your number two is my number all one. Right. Really just sort of as a sports fan, sort of quintessential roller coaster of emotions. We were up. And then we were, it looked like we were going to lose everything. Yep. So I'm going Butler as my number one moment. You know, that iconic moment where he ducks in front of the receiver right on the goal yep. line to make Perfect that Perfect timing. Couldn't have timed it any better. And your number two is my number one. I'm taking Vinatieri as the number one, that Super Bowl against the Rams. Obviously, Rob already explained it with uh, John Madden saying, what are the Patriots doing? They should just kneel down, go to overtime. Who's this Brady guy? A lot of people still didn't really know what it was all about. 
great comeback. And there are the top five moments. Of course, we left a lot of them out, so you can uh, give us an email or something. Give us a call and let us know what your favorite moment is. Check out the website, YCNnow.com, for all the replays and for our upcoming schedule of Game of the Week. Rob, thanks for coming in. All right. Great to see you. Thanks for watching YCN Sports Talk.